Hi, well in this film I'm going to be using the X-Carve with a laminate trimmer on it. We've actually decided to have a go at putting a slightly larger motor on to actually give the X-Carve a little bit more oomph. The motor it comes with is perfectly alright, but we thought we'd try a little bit of metal on the X-Carve and some more wood as well. So the actual machine we're using, it's the Makita laminate trimmer, 700 watt, and it has a quarter inch collet. Well, to make the conversion, we had to get a new back plate for the X-Carve. And we initially made one out of Tufnol using some plans off the Inventables website. And the, the Tufnol wasn't really quite strong enough. So we decided actually it was far easier just to get a back plate from Inventables. They're $6 a piece, and so not very expensive. And we put that in. Once you've got your back plate, you then need to attach the laminate trimmer to the back plate. And we made an HD PE block to hold the laminate trimmer. And to actually get the right diameter hole, we used a 64 millimeter hole cutter just using a basic hole cutter set to get a nice hole of the right size. One could do it on a bandsaw, one could do it by hand as well I guess with a coping saw. But it seemed easier just to use the, the hole saws. And then we put a, a bolt through to act as a clamping mechanism to actually hold the, X, to hold the laminate trimmer onto the back plate. The HDPE is actually secured to the back plate by a row of ordinary wood screws. So nothing complicated there. Well, to test this out, John's going to be making a cameraman's front box and he's going to be using a mixture of quarter inch and one eighth inch end mills in the laminate trimmer. And the actual front box itself is going to be made as it's a prototype out of an old wine box. And then later on, he's going to try other materials as well. I well, certainly found doing this, once you've got your design, it's really quick. And you could turn out lots of these really quickly as well. We're really impressed with the Makita laminate trimmer in the X-Carve. The X-Carve hasn't given up at all at any stage. It's been absolutely rock solid. And the Makita trimmer does a great job as well. So anyway, hope you enjoyed seeing that one. We think it's well worth trying if you want to do some slightly heavier work. And thanks for watching. Bye bye.